This is Princey Seat's channel, your preferred channel for most current and detailed content and information needed. You are welcome. If you are new kindly subscribe and press the notification button for onward information. Thank you. This is a very vital information about the courtesy visit to the CBN on disbursement, pay attention to this. Ladies and gentlemen in Grand Community in Nigeria, my name is Pastor Dr. Akanbasi. I come your way to give you a brief update. Continue to pray, most, most especially pray for freedom fighters. Just pray, freedom masses fighter. Just pray for them. They are beginning to take a good step. The step they are taking now is no more a violent step, is no more insult step, is no more abuse or attack step, but it's a step of a polite manner. We have all a, our opinion to Central Bank Governor and the Central Bank itself to fasten the disbursement of the UAAG grants. And our plea will soon reach them and which the plea is demanded or the plea is demanding for a disbursement this week. So pray for the team that will be making reach to the central bank governor. I was opportune to attend the meeting and I have also suggested that we NGOs should sign a letter to the central bank governor for a courtesy visit so that through the courtesy visits the discussion of disbursement can be tender as a uh, as an information to assist for the disbursement yes it is, it is an easy way a courtesy visit remember the central bank governor is not staying too long in office a courtesy visit and that suggestion was seen very important after I laid that suggestion. I mean, Ru have seen it and other persons. So let us continue to pray for those who are fighting to see that disbursement take place. If God will accept our appeal, the disbursement will come this week or likely before this month runs out thank you very much god bless god bless you once again my name is pastor akanbasi your friend your brother happy new year once again good day Anywhere where they go, amen. As they amend constitution for Nigeria, if you reach, I go still let masses know. See, see, see where they want amend them, and you know they like this before. Anything I have for human being now, as I'm still breathing in breathing now, is truth. I owe everybody truth to tell people truth. Nothing but the truth, and nothing anybody go feel do me. See, now I am not being paid by anybody. Nobody they pay me salary bite us since seven years let us see it as mosquito no be scorpion no be snake let's see it as mosquito you know mosquito bite now nah, it's not it's not serious something but, but i will cause you malaria you treat the malaria you keep on living so we see it as mosquito bite us since seven years that one don't go do you see anybody coming up again <laughs> it will not be easy for that person to penetrate to scam masses Unless those foolish, foolish, gullible Nigerians 
that would be so stupid to to take the hard earned money. Nobody know how. Nobody don't know how Nigeria is now. Some people to feed now. They find it they very 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 difficult to feed. What's square me? I know what I'm saying. I know what I'm going through. So in the hand of people. So when I tell you that some people find it very difficult to eat a day, believe me, because I know what I'm going through here in the hand of people. Some people will eat in the in the afternoon. They will stay till another afternoon, nothing to put inside this mouth to chew, to eat it. Because most of them have no job. Some of them, they, know, they don't even have source of surviving in this grand community. I know as at the battle, it's not that Jennifer Isaac I have, but I'm a humanitarian, I know what I'm going through for all these people. You hear me talking about now. So if you will be a normal human being created by God, and there is nobody that God have not put in sense after creating human being, breathe into him. Another thing that he put in human, in human brain is sense. He created you, brought you on earth here to the foolish. They carry your money, they sprinkle everywhere. Some of you people, if you don't have, when one or two people convince you, you will run, go to Napo, go to uh, AB Microfinance, go to where you will uh, put yourself in tight corner. You, some of us women will not even tell our husband. We will go borrow Igbese. You carry Garanto. Garanto. You call your girlfriend or woman friend. You will go stand Garanto for you. Collect money. Some of all these uh, uh, microfinance, they will say, who is the next of kin? You carry an innocent husband that did not know anything. You put him. You are, you are tampering with your marriage. Be that. Marriage that you have been living, you people have been staying together since without grants, living peacefully, love each other.